Let's see which drone we shall use. Let's start... Here. Yeah, that seems like a good point. Alright. So this is a minigame then. Okay. And this here drone... Acts in a super weird... Oh, oh. We have something here. Find her! Find her now! And a strong message! I suspect that send a strong message is obviously spoken by Cobblepot, the penguin. And I'm also going to say that her is Catwoman. Which means that we will have to save Catwoman from losing her fluffy little ears at one point or another. That is as, a, as interesting a game, a mini game, as I have ever played. Ah. Charming. Very charming, old boy. Oh boy. This is Arkham, isn't it? Alright. Skyline Club. Yep. Skyline Club. Jeez, no surprise there. Wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Going to speak with him, Bruce? Bruce Wayne already tried talking with Cobblepot. It's time he met the Batman. Good. Time to beat up a f uh, well, what? A childhood friend? Hardly. His parents probably killed my parents, so I don't feel. All that friendly towards him. I'm doing this midday? Well, afternoon. Do you know? Let's see. Come on, come on. I know there's going to be more around here. The man probably had millions in his soap drawer. If, if Falcone finds out I helped you, he'll kill me. My boss won't be doing much of anything. What's that bloke? Yep, yeah, Falcon is dead. You don't need to worry about him. You just need to worry about me. Hmm. Ouch! You lot, come check out this office. Not much left of the whole office space. You can help me. Let him go. Sorry to interrupt. Batman! It's about time. You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. <laughs> but don't worry, I'll pass your gratitude on to those who made it happen. They'll be pleased to know you think so highly of their work. You used an innocent cop to do your dirty work. I know how you've been using the drugs you stole at the docks. Where are they? Is this about Falcone? No, it's we not all about Falcone. Saw how felt about Falcone. Uh. Pounded him into a pulp on live TV. I if did. You were yes. truly the defender of this city. You'd have finished the job yourself. Admit it, Falcone deserves to die. It's a job for justice. Vermin like Falcone, they deserve to be stomped out. Believe me, I know from personal experience. You don't decide who lives and who dies. That's not justice. But it's bloody well satisfying, isn't it? As a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. Good man. How's about we talk this through? We helped you with Falcone. Now, oh, did you know? Just cut out the rest of the rot, like Wayne and Hill. Ordinary folks might be able to breathe. 
What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? What does Bruce Wayne have to do with this? Pretty boy's got himself a fat bank account, thanks to his parents. Only problem is, they took that money from people that couldn't fight back. Here's the thing. I and your parents didn't? Batman. We both want the same kinds of things. Do we now? more people, we've got big plans for Gotham. Care to share? They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal. She didn't make good on it. That's because of me, I'm so afraid. So sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay to watch. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Oh, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful name! <laughs> Not as beautiful as your face is going to be once I'm done with you. Whoa, you're a big one. But I'm a lot faster than you are. <laughs> oh, I will. Give me a button. So far, so good. He's gone. Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. This is going to be problematic, isn't it? Never mind. Bit I was looking forward to taking out the big guy. Next time. Six PM no capes. Is that me? That's me. Oh my god, I'm out of my suit. Unbearable. Let me guess, things are about to get white. <laughs> I love my reaction. Is that Bruce Wayne? You really think he'd show up here? And interesting in the Duke drinking, dancing, and fighting. Necessarily in that order. Hmm. Here, cops raided his house. Sorry, his manor. Anything else you have to say about me, boys? A new twist in the race for the mayor's office as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as, well, the jealous sort. Very possessive of his toys. Oh, come now, Hill. This is going to blow up in your face, you know. Lying always does. You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Do you know Selena Kyle? There are men after her. Uh-huh. When aren't there? <laughs> well, these ones are trying to kill her. Hey. Don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. Cops uh... take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Uh, buy you a drink? How about a few? Sure. <laughs> it ain't like you're short on cash. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. You didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. I didn't. Nice guy, man, just now. And you come and ruin it, Selena. Selena, I need Typical. to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. 
Sorry about that. things went down the way they did. But I have information. The man who hired you. His name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I don't kill. I'm dead anyway. I'm you gonna help you, sweetheart. You really screw them. The penguin. <laughs> it's not my fault that you're in this, Selena, but I can help you out of it. Tell me what you know about Penguin. I only know him by reputation. And I'm what reputation is that? He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? <laughs> you two have a lot in common. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Definitely well, I'm not, not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. I need your help. I need you, Selena. That right? If Penguin is as deadly as you say, I need all the help I can get. I'm gonna play yes. on her ego. Sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us, working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. You and Harvey, it's pretty clear you aren't just friends. Please, I'm just toying with him. Oh. I only take my claws out for someone special. You and I... Don't that look problematic? Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. <laughs> I do believe it's hello. Oh, so there is going to be some music Peter, for, for fighting. If you care about your own skin, you'll get the hell out. She's with me. I think you need to leave. Oh, well. This is gonna be fun! <laughs> I told ya! Let's boogie! <laughs> nice. <laughs> you boys got no shot. Hmm, where should I? Yeah. Oi, that might have been a bit too rough, don't you think, Brucey boy? <laughs> Not done yet. They never are. Do you know why? Because they never learn. Thank God I'm good at pressing buttons. Let's give it to him. Whoa, nice. <laughs> ah, 
I'm betting this is gonna hurt all of you a lot more than me. Nice. Whew. Appreciate the workout. You fight pretty good for such a pretty boy. The police, which is probably. Yeah. Come on, this way. Yep, yep. My thoughts exactly. Thank God I'm working with Master Thief, who knows just when to get out of a scene in order to avoid a yet bigger scene. <laughs> Quick, check the alleyway! Uh oh. Anything. Negative, Nothing. let's check the other side. Good call. Are we alone? Yes, we are. Yeah, we're, we're alone. Oh, and this is not going to end well. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I should have probably back to I'll take away. the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Will I see you again? When will I see you again? <sighs> when you least expect it. Cocky, I like. You shouldn't trust me, you know. I don't. That's still my toy. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of the smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Ooh. Fancy. Uh, processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Oh, I see. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about. Yeah, Hill's working good. with them. Why am I not surprised? The guest. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking, and they're to trying Penguin, to take me down. Something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but. If I may offer a word of advice, people look up to Batman after how you handled Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Interesting. I think I'm gonna do this as Bruce. Just because this is Obviously my more Brucey playthrough. Yeah. Going as Bruce is the smart choice. I'm toxic right now in high in higher society, so I might as well use some of that toxicity around the good mayor. Let's see how he'll like some of that negative publicity. Sorry, the mayor's busy. Do you have an appointment? Do you know uh, who I am? The mayor's know? doing debate prep. He really can't be disturbed right now. Well, I was really hoping you'd be able to help me out. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe I could return the favor one day. It seems you do have an appointment, Mr. Wayne. Oh. Silly me. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Bruce Wayne? Yes. Finally, you've come to see me. Of course, only after your name's been dragged through the mud. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad to see you. But you're a day late and a great many dollars short. We can be friends, Hill. 
I'd like us to put aside our differences. It's easy to ask for peace when you've already lost the war. But I, I haven't. I really want to deny a fresh start. Your father and I, we took this city and made it ours. Falcone too. So people soul. keep we telling me. We built everything we have. You were born with it. A young man like you wouldn't understand what it takes to rise to the top. Oh, I understand. Very well. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Sounds like me. Yes, it does. It is you. So, what's your point? I take it you have one. Or are you just fond of my dulcet tones? Why attack, Why me? attack me? Because of Dent and the campaign? I'm in Kalapot's crosshairs, same as you. But you fed them dirt on me. Only the files I seized from Wayne Manor. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. Not How anymore, do you think your family so, got the land do you? Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Oh, family interesting. Along with the rest of their assets. He is very dangerous, so. Even if that's true, it's no excuse for Cobblepot's crimes. I quite agree. It doesn't hurt to understand your enemy's motives. There's so much more I could share, if only we were friends. I could help you deal with Penguin, let you in on some family history. But I'm caught in a dogfight for my political career, and my rival has bottomless pockets. Strange how that rival was. were to say, drop out, or his advertising spend were to dry up. I might have a lot more resources for helping a new friend. Hmm. I could do that, but I'm not going to. Not a chance, Hill. I'm not cutting Harvey loose. Well, you dropped on your head. When the mayor of Gotham extends a hand, you take it. I don't need your hand. Not with your voice on tape. You forget who you're talking to. I'm the man that says I never left such and such a message. And all the judges bow their heads and say, Yes, sir. I'm that the man is until who sends Dent. the police to your house to take your things. And I give them to whoever I please. You're nothing oh. like your father. You'd never have the backbone to do what we did. You are very wrong about that. I'm Leon. the heavyweight, Wayne. And you're punching above your weight. Get out of the ring before you get hurt. I know exactly who I'm talking to. I'm the man who'd throw you over this rail without a second thought, and my lawyers make this whole thing disappear before you hit the ground. <laughs> yes, laugh that voice with makes it such papers, nervousness. Or anywhere else I don't like. I'll turn my commissioner loose on your lieutenant for that fiasco down at the precinct. Gordon? And then I'll turn him on you and Dent for being there. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a debate to prep for. Get him out of here. Whatever deal you made with Penguin, he won't honor it. Don't worry about me. You should watch your own back. Oh, my dear Mr. Mayor. You just made so many wrong moves. Alfred, get a warning to Gordon. Tell him to increase security of the debate. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. I hate how unoptimized this episode is. Constant frame drops below 60. Ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. I wonder what else is on here. You will find out soon enough. Let me once again try and work through these abysmal settings. Yeah, render quality on the highest. Yeah, probably not. Let's see if there is any difference. Probably not. 
As per your request, nope. Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, so. Thank him. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security surprising. cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Oh yes, safety is my number Hells, one concern. Details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To hear their crimes detailed. First by a Falcone, then by a snake like Hill. It makes me question myself. You shouldn't, Bruce. You are your own man. And the city needs you. Now more than ever. I hope you're right, Alfred. I'll, uh, I'll leave you to it then. <laughs>